Now we'll see another way of creating a member. In the last tutorial you have seen two ways of creating a new member inside the PDS. The first way was first you have cut the lines and then you have typed yes and uh, you have entered the new member. Other way was using a create command. Now we will see a another way of doing a new member or creating a new member. Okay, you type create okay dot zf dot zf and dot zl this is first and last line okay and you can give the number name new mem new mem 3 okay if you wanted to store this i mean if you wanted to have this piece of code into the same library that is in, inside the jcl lib then you can use this command see the member successfully created let's go back and refresh you can see new member 3 has been successfully created.